and you really must tune in. He's ironic, iconic, maybe bionic. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Nerd Genius. He's a genius. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, Michael Burr, Hat from Nerd Genius and Retro One Man, and I'm here with. Hi, I'm Mike Hansen, uh, the one man games developer, better known as Psychotic Software. So tell us a little bit about um, what, what you're doing here today. Yeah, well, basically, what I'm doing is. Um, I am pushing my first game power, which I spent the last, the last two years making. Um, it's out on Xbox, it's out on most PC, but one place it's not out is Steam. Uh, it's currently in the Steam Greenlight process. It's at the time of writing 87% of the Yes Go to get published on Steam. Um, so I'm here with a load of little QR codes to take people straight to that Steam page and vote yes. Um, and hopefully, it's a very retro. Uh, Retro related events, so hopefully people will get power up and vote uh, well, yes. Okay, uh, so tell us a little bit about the game. What, what was the process behind it? What made you say one day, hey, you know what, I'm gonna make a game? Yeah, so well, I spent the last sort of. I mean, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a games artist by trade, so I do uh, casual games these days, some more TV based. And while I enjoy doing it, it's not my passion. The reason I got into games is the retro games I grew up on, essentially. I wanted to make those. So, um, one day, my missus said to me, you're going to go nuts doing this. Go upstairs, see your office, make the game you want to make, or make one of the games you want to make, see if you can do it. And I've been dabbling for years in uh, very basic programming. So, I have some ideas on how to go with game logic. Um, I turned that into something practical, basically. I'm part of the game that I made. Uh, oh, look, for the Xbox. Uh, for the indie arcade on Xbox 360 uh, at the time. It went down very well. They got a feature from Microsoft. They got a lot of uh, people saying, why don't you put this on PC? Yeah. This is what I did. Um, as I say, it took me two years to make the game. It took me about three months to get it on PC. It's recently hit PC. Uh, you'll find that on a lot of stores. As I say, Steam is the, Steam is the place that I really want to be. Because uh, that's, you know, where everyone buys. <laughs> yeah, no, of course. So, uh, basically, as well, you can see a lot of the old games in there as well, like Gradius, you've got some, some little uh, yeah. sort of uh, R type in there as well, and all the other, like, sort of, uh, I'd say the uh, side scrolling shooters that yeah, yeah. you to love. It's, it's, it's very based on the 16 bit era. Um, I, like to, I mean, when I started it, I was basically trying to reproduce Project Dex, that was kind of yeah. Team 17 right here, was back in the day. And that was one of the games I really thought. Oh, you know, super wrong, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Assassin, I don't think that was actually a thing, but it's a great game. A lot of Team 17 games. Yeah, they really produced a lot of stuff for the Amiga 500, didn't they? Yeah, the Commodore, yeah. yeah. Which was, you know, which was, which was my era very much. Yes. Um, yeah, I wanted to kind of, I wanted to kind of get a sense of what that was all about yes. across to a generation who totally didn't get to appreciate it, didn't get to live through it. So I'm kind of trying to do that with my games. That's kind of, that's kind of what it's about, really. Um, Power Up is a classic size from the shooter, but I will be moving it to other genres of that era, you know. Well, so guys, if you know what you can do to support it, get it on Xbox Live. Uh, get it, is it on PSN? Not yet, not yet. It's coming to iOS pretty soon, and then Android as well after that, not long after, that's the plan. Uh, and I'm hoping to get a bit onto to Uria, because uh, I love that. And it's, it's, you know, it's, it's a well, you've got to support it because it's one of those consoles that you're out there that's made for you. Absolutely, and also it's an Android device, and me and a friend of mine are doing an Android version of it, so it makes sense to get it on there. Uh, yeah, and then after that, uh, we'll look at what the options are in terms of other devices and what the demand is. Yeah, great. So, guys, make sure you support this. Uh, do you have a Facebook page? Certainly do. Uh, Facebook slash Psychotic Software, all one word. Uh, I'm also very prolific on Twitter. Uh, PSY, PSOFT, Psychsoft, that's me. And you'll hear me banging on about this stuff all day long. And guys, make sure you support it as well. We make sure we put the, the code at the bottom. I'll put the link at the bottom of this uh, YouTube video as well. And as always, guys, my prefer had saying that we've got gameplay. Have you?
the power of the dark side. Two, one, zero.